The NBC regional manager for Mwai FM, Susan Mafale, expressed the team's gratitude for the leadership's visit, noting its significance in contributing to staff morale. But we are blessed to have a DG like Mr. Smilo, um, who would always take the people's interest at heart. It is a way of motivating us to make sure we also plow back to NBC. It's a way of showing we cannot just be money collectors or salary collectors. Rather, we must make sure we deliver. We also do our part as NBC employees. The appreciation party is one of many being held in each of the public broadcasters' regional stations across the country, which the Director General explained is a way to thank the employees for their tireless and continued contributions towards serving the nation, especially during key periods and events, including the COVID-19 period, the death of late President Hage Kinkop, and the 2024 independent celebrations. The NBC, he said, managed to navigate these developments despite various challenges and pressures dealt with over that period. Tonight, really, is just about saying thank you very, very much for your inputs as a unit, for your inputs individually, and for your input as a region. Without you, the NBC can't exist. Stanley Similo also met with the team for a number of presentations on the company's operational matters and other issues and expressed appreciation for the regional colleagues' contributions, which have garnered positive feedback and served to better not only the original stations, but the entire corporation. Even though we did presentation, our job was to come in here with a view to listen. <clears throat> Great comment came out of in terms of what we should be doing for the organization within this region that will ultimately also impact the bigger <coughs> NBC. These are things that we will take back, that I will take back and then discuss with others because we need to start influencing each other. Similar gatherings have been held at Vantuk, Oshakati and Rundu while staff at Kirman's Web, Swakopmund, Oshiwarongo, Tsumkwe and Khobabas are to be engaged in due time.